All right, the band played on at Dwayne Carlson Stadium in Mana High's homecoming, but it's time now to talk nine man football. And it was a history making night tonight in Powers Lake, and Nolan was on hand for that one. Yeah, it was just last year that, the pow that Powers Lake moved as a co op from Stanley to Ray. As part of that co op agreement, Powers Lake was given the chance to host one home game a year, which required the installation of new lights, which made their debut tonight. And it couldn't have been a bigger matchup as the Ray Powers Lake Outlaws hosted Mohal Lansford Sherwood in a battle of Region 6 unbeatens with the winner to hold the inside track to the region title. As we head out to Powers Lake, picking this one up right off the bat, Outlaws on their opening drive and on a fourth and long play, Kyle Van Berkham would sling one over the middle for Noah Schrader. He would pull it down and head into the end zone to open the scoring in this one. Mavericks look to answer soon after. Nate Beha would keep it himself and head up the gut. Ball pops loose as he crosses the goal line. Henry Savakul will jump on it for the insurance. That game was tied at six after one. Outlaws starting the second the same way they did the first. Van Berkham would find a wide open Aiden Nordloff over or off the play action. Pardon me. He would have nothing but room to run as he takes it all the way for the 65 yard score to make it a 13 6 game. MLS looking to answer. Beha would go downfield for Zane Wenstead, but instead Mason Pippen makes an unbelievable one handed interception to give his team the ball back. And on the very next play, it would be Brock Vile taking the handoff. And finding a big hole, that's all he would need as he rumbles 85 yards for the score to make it a big 20-6 to lead in the second quarter. And I say that because Ray Powers Lake would go on to hold this one and pick up a very narrow one-point victory. 27-26 was the final in that one over in... Surrey, or pardon me, Surrey took down Trenton 62-12, uh, to 12, another nine-man action. It was Divide County getting Tioga 46-12. to 12. Central McLean got Mott Region 44 to 22. TGU took down Benson County 48 to 28. St. John got North Star by a score of 74 to 36. And then it was New Rockford Cheyenne taking down Laramore 50 to 12.